joined this morning by the Morden Fire Captain, Jonathan Baumgart. Welcome here. Thank you very much. And we're excited to talk about Hydrant Heroes, a new thing that we're seeing over on the uh, Facebook page for Morden Fire and Rescue. But before we get into that, uh, talk about using social media. You guys have really taken advantage of, uh, of this with the community. Yeah, so uh, Morden Fire and Rescue uh, jumped into social media. Actually, we're still pretty new to the game. We've only been on for about two years, but we're both on Facebook and Instagram. And it's a great way for us to interact with the community and show the community what we're up to and share safety initiatives and that sort of thing. So it's been a great uh, tool for us as a department. And one of the safety initiatives you guys have been sharing is uh, the secondary exits, making sure they are clear after every right. single snowfall here in the Pemina Valley. <laughs> right, so uh, we're looking, uh, going back to our elementary school days and our fire escape plans, we're looking for two exits out of every room of your home. So one thing that we're pushing for residents is to make sure that your basement windows are clear, especially you have uh, individuals sleeping in the basement or you have a basement apartment. You want to make sure that you have your secondary exit there so those windows need to be clear of snow. And once they are clear of snow, we want to make sure that they're open. It's great to have a window cleared, but if the window doesn't open, that doesn't really help us out. So make sure your windows are opening as well. And also take in consideration your back door of your house. That's a secondary, secondary exit. We want to make sure our decks are clear of snow so we can get out of the house when we need to. And so there's some photo examples you guys have shared over there That's on correct, Facebook. Yep. People can check out too. And then on top of that, this hydrant hero idea. If you haven't uh, got enough clearing done from uh, cleaning out the windows, uh, you can go and clear out a hydrant. Yes. Talk about what this is. So uh, we've uh, partnered with Subway Restaurant in Morden. And we are encouraging residents of the community to go out and clear snow around their neighborhood fire hydrant. Um, the city of Morden has just shy of 400 hydrants. So as a department, it's very difficult for our members to go out and look after that, especially after every snowfall. So if then uh, the community can look after their neighborhood fire hydrant, that's beneficial to us. Um, having the hydrant clear and accessible speeds up our process of putting water on a fire if there is a fire in the neighborhood. So to clear out the hydrant, we're looking to have three feet of snow cleared around the hydrant, and then a path from the front of the hydrant to the street. So that gives our members the ability to pull hose in and work around that hydrant without being obstructed with snow. Absolutely, and you were saying that uh, if it wasn't cleared, it'd be up to the uh, the fire department to clear those in, in an emergency, and, and that kind of uh, waste of time wouldn't be good. Right, so as a department, we're hoping to get water flowing from a hydrant within about a minute and a half. That's our goal. Uh, doing some preliminary testing and timing around town we are finding that it's about five and a half to six minutes for us to clear a hydrant and flow water when it's covered in snow. So every second counts and having that is a, having a clear hydrant definitely speeds up the process and helps us expansionally. And clearing a hydrant is uh, all, all well and good. It's a great thing to do, but if somebody wants a little bit of credit for it, uh, they can get involved with you. Can you talk about how to do that? Right, so uh, with this Hydrant Heroes contest, we're looking for individuals to submit a before and after photo of their fire hydrant and a group photo with the individuals that did clean out the hydrant and submit it to our social media platforms. So at Facebook at Morden Fire and Rescue or Instagram at Morden Fire and Rescue. And that photo being submitted enters you into the contest. And we're going to have a draw early next week for the first winner for the month of February and another draw for a winner in March. So we got lots of snow, lots of opportunities to enter. Every hydrant cleared is a new ballot into the contest. So we encourage you individuals to jump on board and enter in and so there's no limit to how many hydrants one person there is can no do. limit nope. <laughs> the more you do the better actually get the friends together it's a Absolutely. good workout yeah, yeah exactly yep awesome well jonathan thanks so much for coming in this morning thanks ronnie